Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today we're going to work with She Modern Stencils again, so those of you who entered the giveaway can get an idea of how to use them. Um, I've already filmed <laughs> the nail design and there was a little oops in there, but it's okay, it all worked out good. Um, I didn't pre-do any of this, you know, to see if it would work out. So just got to filming and decided to kind of roll with it. So I hope you like this one. I'll show you a picture of what we're creating and then I'll show you how I did it and how I didn't do it. <laughs> anyway, so let's just get started. Okay, we're gonna do something a little bit different. So I've got my stamper head and um, it's turned upside down. And I'm gonna use this stencil right here. So I'm really excited about doing this. Okay, so we're going to remove the stencil and stick it on the stamper head. Oh, you can't see that. So we're just going to put um, this black paper underneath. There we go. You can kind of see the little, I'm going to use that little flower right there. Now I'm going to take some gel polish and I'm going to brush it over the image. And I'm going to lift it up okay that turned out pretty good so now I'm going to cure it and while that's curing I'm just going to take some alcohol on a cotton round and then just gently wipe that off okay well, it's perfectly clean okay so this has been cured so now I'm going to take the large flower image and put it right over that. Push it down. Well, there's still a tacky layer on that flower, so you want to be careful of that. Then I'm going to take my pink hollow sparkling glitter and I'm just going to dab a little bit. Rub it around inside the stencil. Then you clean your finger off with the lint roller. Try to get a little bit more glitter on here. Now to clean off the stencil part, you can either use a removable scotch tape or you can you know, just kind of like put some tape on your finger, pop this up, and then it won't be quite so sticky so it won't you know distort your stencil. So just remove that extra. Okay, and I don't see any extra glitter hanging out and that looks great. Okay, so now that this is done, we're just gonna set it aside. I'll be using Wave Gel's Shiny No Clean Top Gel today and the Base Gel. So we'll start out by applying the Base Gel. And you just want to apply that in thin coats. So I'm going to do that on all of my nails and then cure. So now I'm going to apply Lost Flip Flop Mood Gel. So 
is a light pink and I believe it shifts to white if I remember correctly. Okay. And if you get a little on the side, you want to make sure that you remove that before curing in your lamp. Okay, now I'm applying a second coat. Okay, so I've got two coats on all of my fingers and I've got the top coat already on this finger and this finger. The rest of them I'm going to wipe off the tacky layer. Now that the tacky layer is removed, I'm going to put a nice thin coat of nail glue. I mean, it's foil glue actually. Make sure that you coat the whole nail really good with the with the foil glue or the um, glitter is not going to stick to it. Okay, we just have to wait for that to dry. So when it turns clear, then it'll be dry and we'll be ready to go. Okay, and now that the glue is dry, we are going to stick the flower on. And I just noticed that the flower isn't center. The center of the flower isn't in the center, but that's okay. Because what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put, I think, part of the flower in this part of my finger, like right here. There we go. And now I'm just going to clean up the edges and a couple of these spots that ended up where I don't want them. Okay, so I want to show you what I'm going to do at the end because part of it, I think, is that flower right there um, that is sticking out. So I'm just going to trim that because that is already cured gel. It keeps popping up. Oh, well, that looks cute. <laughs> okay, well, it fell off, but it still looks cute. I like I like the center of that with just a little sparkle. So I'm going to leave it and in my next video we'll figure out how to make this stick. <laughs> but otherwise I kind of really like how that looks. So we're going with that. The rest of the nails will be much easier. So we're just going to remove the rest of the glitter off of that stamper head. We're going to get the little sheet ready again. I'm going to poke that down, and these ones are all just going to be glitter flowers. Just popping that in there. Lifting up the stencil really carefully. And I don't see any other glitter on that. So I'm just going to put some flowers over here. Perfect. And after every time you do this, you're going to have to clean that stamper head. Okay, that's good. Right, and then you're going to have to clean this. You have to clean this off. 
the little alcohol pad. There we go. And put that on there and do it again. This takes very little glitter to do this. You don't need a lot. Let the flower looks pretty good. So we'll pop one down here. There, I like that. And then I think I'm gonna go with a big one and a little one over here. Okay, since I'm going with the big one, the little one, I'm just gonna pop some glitter on here. good lift up then I'm going to do a big one kind of right down here in the corner and the little one right up here I did get some little dusting of glitter. If you do that, you can just pick it off with a little sharp tool or just kind of, there we go. Kind of push it back towards the glitter flower. Or a third option would be just to put some speckles all over. You don't have to worry about it then. Okay, so that's tedious. I'm going to do it off camera and then I'll come back. Now you want to be careful with the top coat so you're not like dragging the glitter into the polish um you know because you've got glue all over this place so um you you want to be careful while you're doing that um so you just want to take a good amount just like if it was like a stamped image so you want to take a good amount of top coat on there and just kind of glide it I like to glide it kind of over the stamped image And then maybe just, or the glittered image, and then maybe just cure that. And then come back and do the whole nail. So that that's, that's what I'm most comfortable doing, so that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so now I'm ready just to top coat the whole nail now. And then I'm going to cure that and we'll come back for the final look. So here's the finished Manny. I really like how it came out. Um, let me get my fingers warm and we'll um, see what it looks like when they're, when the color is warm. And here's what they look like when they're warm. Nice and white. It, well, that one's already gotten cold again. It's kind of really cold in here. Um, so that's pretty cool. I just, I really love this one. <laughs> I just, I love all of them. I love all my little nail polish babies. Um, anyways, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching and bye for now.